We're here to talk about uh, how your business helped us at uh, Sanford Children's Hospital. And tell me about the project. Well, it was an interesting project. The concept was that we wanted to have a castle, and the theme in the castle was a treasure hunt to the castle. And the idea was to get the children out of the patient rooms and into the corridors and into the playrooms, creating patterns and ribbons in the floor that they could follow. So through stars and ribbons, they found their way. What type of material did you use? And we came up with Gerflor, and we were very lucky to have their salespeople work with us to ensure that the client felt very comfortable with the product, as I really liked the product. It was beautiful material, it had beautiful colors, and it had the durability and the cushion that was needed for the poor people that are working all day, 24 hours, working with these children. I was sold on it, but we had to have the client uh, agree to that, and they were very helpful. We put some test pieces down in their elevators, and because we did that, they were very comfortable with it, and as a result, we have beautiful floors. How did this happen um, in Philadelphia to South Dakota? When we had specified the materials, there was a question as to how all of these intricate star patterns and ribbons were going to be cut into the flooring, but we didn't know if we had anybody out there in Sioux Falls that could do it. They had a limited labor pool there. So thank goodness Philip uh, met me there at our office and showed me his important materials. And because of that, <clears throat> we have a beautiful project. Because the water cutting is superior to what they were going to try and do, which was cut by hand. I mean, you have to be really patient and have a lot of time to do that and it's, I don't even know if you could do it. There was questions about specifications and they came, your company came back with us with documentation with all the drawings that we needed to uh, review carefully what was going on, where we wanted the patterning, how we were going to place things. I think the thing that saved us was having water jet in the spec because if we didn't have that we would have been at the mercy of the contractor and not you know, that some people believe they can do things and they really can't, so it's better to have that up front so you're sure that the end result is going to make everybody look good.